are continuing to follow that breaking news at Westchester's largest city tonight where a Yonkers sergeant is dead after a multi vehicle crash. Now this happened on Tuckahoe Road. News 12's Ben Nandy has been on the scene for us all night and joins us now with an update. Ben. Hi, Ian. Yeah, it's still a pretty active scene here. It's uh, been like this pretty much since 3.30 when this all happened. And uh, Tuckahoe Road is still closed in both directions. No real sign of when it's going to open back up again. And I want to show you video of, that we took earlier today. You'll see a bus. You'll see two cars. Yonkers PD is telling us that there were 30 passengers, about 30 passengers inside that bus, and they were treated at the scene. They are okay. We're also told that the bus driver uh, has injuries, but is okay. The BMW driver, you see a BMW there uh, next to the bus. That person is in critical condition, and the other driver of the other car, a longtime member of Yonkers PD, a captain who was on duty at the time, he was taken to Jacoby Medical, and he later died. Police believe the sergeant was driving west on Tuckahoe, and that's when a BMW came from the opposite direction, crossed over, and hit the sergeant's car and then that bus. Ever since, Yonkers PD, Westchester County Police, New York State Police, they've been here holding down the scene and collecting evidence. Police are asking people to please uh, avoid this area. It's shut down. We still have about 30 police cruisers here in the area. They still need to remove vehicles uh, from the scene. Drivers, if they are uh, coming eastbound on Tuckahoe, they are being diverted south of here, and they have to take a few turns in order to get to the other side of the sprain. Uh, now I want to go to my colleague Jonathan Gordon. He's just outside Jacoby Medical. And Jonathan, I understand you got a hold of some exclusive video. Well, what's it show? Yeah, well, Ben, uh, the video shows the bus in frame just moments before uh, this crash, and you actually do hear the impact. Take a listen. It really is a tragic scene, and this evening, dozens of Yonkers police officers lined up outside the trauma unit here at Jacoby Medical Center in the, in the Bronx, flashing their lights for several minutes, almost as a way to say goodbye to their fallen brother. And then shortly after, a procession of vehicles left here, presumably with uh, the body of that sergeant. It has been a really urgent scene here at the hospital, with police cars flying in and out of the facility all night. And we do know that this was a 24-year Yonkers police sergeant who did die here at Jacoby shortly after the BMW hit him head on. He was on duty in an unmarked car and the only one in that vehicle at the time of the crash. Police say their hearts are broken tonight and are asking the public to keep the sergeant's family in their thoughts and prayers. And at this moment, police are withholding the identity of this officer until his family has been fully notified. In the Bronx, Jonathan Gordon, News 12.